Alright, so I saved a guy a lot of money the other day for not having to go to a shop because he had accidentally done something. Alright, let's crank up. Let's see if we can crank up, stay cranked. Hmm. This one's been sitting at the house a minute. It's not out of gas. Hmm. It's an AC going up in this joint. It's hot. Alright, so. So we're gonna go, we're in neutral, right? We moved to neutral. But you're stuck off road, you've tried your center locking differential, that's not working. You tried second start, that's not working. And you need to get in the low range. Go back in neutral on your transmission. Put this to neutral, let the transmission slow down. Okay, what's fixing to happen is the transmission is completely disengaged here. I can go to drive, no matter if I'm gonna drive or not. I can't go anywhere. I have completely disengaged my transmission here. If you're in neutral, you cannot move no matter what. So keep that in mind that that's not something you can do. So he had accidentally put it in neutral, didn't realize that he couldn't move, and there was his problem. Go to left. Let's go back to drive. Whoa, I can move. All right, right? Come back to neutral. Again, I cannot move in neutral. Come back to my high gear for going on the road. No grinding that way. Pause in the middle. That's the biggest mistake I guess we all make is we are some impatient individuals. Anyway, I gotta mess with this thing. I gotta move it real quick. Because, uh, well, let's just do that while I'm sitting here with you guys because I gotta move the grass under it. And I need to show it off to a couple of guys that are interested in buying this one. So I'm uh, fixing to get some pictures and uh, see if either of these guys want to buy it. and how they want to build it but if that's if you're wanting to go if you're wanting to put your transmission from high to low range you're probably very very stuck one if you're not very very stuck you really probably don't even need that you don't need to be in low range um but if you find yourself in a very stuck situation and you've locked your center diff and you're splitting your power front to rear like your center diff does guess what you've got a low range at that point so that your wheels aren't going to spin as fast um, the Lexus is built with A-Track. You've got active traction control with your ABS system already built in. So if you're in low range, you're stuck stuck. But anyway, if you do find yourself stuck stuck, that's how you get out. I hope. If not, I hope you got a winch. But anyway, I hope that's helpful to somebody. Maybe it keeps you from sending your truck to a shop because you thought that it would still drive in neutral as far as that high-low range. It will not. So, um... Just a heads up there. You cannot move if you're in high, not in high or low on your transmission on the GX470. Make sure that you're in high or low. You're sitting in neutral. Transmission is completely disengaged. So, a little education for the day. Like, subscribe, all that fun stuff. We'll catch you next time.